bomb. Let's go for another news about Rafael Nadal. Subscribe to our channel to always receive new news. Patrick McEnroe, John McEnroe's brother and former Grand Slam doubles champion, recently discussed Rafael Nadal's participation in the 2023 French Open, the second Grand Slam of the year, on his podcast Holding Court with Patrick McEnroe. McEnroe believes Rafael Nadal should have been in the top two at this year's French Open, even though he is currently ranked outside the top 10. He explained, he has dropped to 15th in the rankings. That will be another interesting aspect. The French Federation, who makes the draws and the rankings, always follows the rules and the rankings. When Rafa faced Djokovic in the quarterfinals, I didn't like it, but they're not going to change that. McEnroe then added, if they haven't changed in the last year I don't imagine they're going to put Rafa as a seed or two, which I personally think they should, at least in the top four because now unless he has a good clay court winning streak, which seems unlikely considering how many he will play, he will be well outside the top 10 when Roland Garros rolls around. That's the biggest unknown we all want to answer. Although he believes that Nadal, having reached this point in his career, does not need much preparation to be competitive on his favorite surface, Patrick explained that the problem with Nadal is much more complex. We don't know if he will be ready. We've seen some videos of him training. He usually likes to play a lot on clay to prepare. He's the type of guy who needs games, but does he really need that many battles at this point in his career? Patrick McEnroe said, if he's physically fit, that's the most important thing for him because he can fight for his place at the French Open. In the first two rounds he usually knocks people out. That allows him to play on court. For some hours. And do you also agree with Patrick McEnroe? Leave your comment that is. Very important. Leave your like and subscribe to the Tennis News Channel. See you later.